So season three is on the road. You see at the end of last season, Shy Baldwin asks Midge to go on tour. The tone is, you know, it's never not Maisel, so it's colorful and bright and fast-paced, filled with energy and hope and joy. Um, but in this season, Midge matures a little bit more than we've ever seen her mature before. That, that's my tease. That's about all I can give away. So Midge matures. Yeah. Sterling K. Brown joins the cast. What yes. can you tell me about him? Oh, man. Absolutely nothing other than that he's fantastic, and we're so lucky to have him. I've been so excited from the minute I heard he was joining. Before then, I wanted him to join us, and... It's, it's been thrilling. Season three is very intense as an actor. It's a lot of big scenes, a lot of massive, massive scenes and long hours and a lot of dialogue, the Paladino style. Um, but yeah, there's a lot at stake. Susie's kind of branching out. Susie does not want to fail. Midge does not want to fail. And they're, they're betting everything on each other. Um, they're all still alive. Um, there are no zombies. Um, nobody flies. Um, you know, we, we, our show is about a woman whose life constantly expands, and when her life blew apart and expanded, it pushed everybody in her stratosphere off course and into a different direction. So season three is even more of now we're seeing how everybody is sort of trying to get like a new trajectory, and Abe and Rose have to figure out what is that life and where are they going to live and be and exist, and Joel has got to like figure out, you know, yes he caused this but what's his next step and so it's we get to explore a lot of that and and see you know our two girls go on the road and see what that experience is like which is really fun so there's a lot it's big